It's the it's the quintessential zombie film. Absolutely perfect work by George A. Romero. If you say so. I'm just not a big horror fan, you know? Don't they get kind of campy after a while? I mean, well, some do, but this is the quintessential zombie film. The one that started it all. You know... Hey, uh, Todd, if you cream your pants one more time over Night of the Living Dead, I swear to God, I'm gonna beat you with this pool cue. <laughs> Chet means it, man. He's fucking crazy. I need a fucking drink. We still have plenty of pop. It means beer, dumbass. I, I can go get that for you guys if you want. What are you, like, 15? Isn't there a curfew tonight? 18, Mark. You know this. Don't, no, seriously, I got this. Don't worry about it. Dude, that ID you have looks fake as shit. Hey, it's worked before, man. I'll be right back, I promise. No, you guys are a bunch of assholes, right? What makes you say that, Aaron? You know he likes you guys, and you kind of treat him like shit. Hey, I just don't like the guy, that's all. I mean, he's a little, well, you know, spooky. I mean, he's obsessed with horror movies. And that instantly makes him a creep? Yeah, pretty much. Why do you even care, Aaron? Well, it, it's just that he's my friend, and I appreciate if you all treated him with some respect. <laughs> Jeez, what's gotten into her tonight? yourself to them. They're all just burnouts. Hey, it's, it's okay. I, I wanted to do this. It's just you're a good guy. I don't want you to feel like you have to prove yourself to anybody. Understand? Yeah, yeah. I, I understand. I'll be right back here, I promise. Oh, um, and hey, don't get too far ahead tonight. There's some scenes in it I really want to watch with you. Okay, you don't have to worry about that. Be safe to me. Yeah, I will be. Would you help me? God. Would you go out with me, Aaron? Shit. So, how are you? Fine, I guess. What are you doing? Nothing really. Uh, uh, so, you wanna smoke with me sometime? Did you just ask me out with pot? Yeah. Probably not one of your best moves, dear. Yeah. Can someone go see if Norman Bates picked up drinks yet? Hey, I thought we talked about the name calling. I'll text him, though. Hey, he already sent me something. Yeah. That's odd. What? What is it? Wait a minute, he wouldn't just bail on us like that. Are you saying that Spooky bailed on us? <laughs> Again with the names, Mark. I don't know. I mean, no. He wouldn't do that. It's unlike him. He really wanted to watch this movie. See? You see? This is why you don't trust the creepy ones, Aaron. They never deliver with the beer. It's whatever, anyway. He probably would have gotten something light. Give me a second. I'm gonna see if I can find something stronger. Now we're talking.
gentlemen, lady, and lightweights, may I introduce you all to my wonderful friend, Jose Cuervo. Should we have shot glasses for this? Nah, it's fine, trust me. Just don't drink too much. And if you do, we got toilets. Are you gonna finish that, Aaron? Um, no, I, I'm actually not feeling too well. I think I'm going to head up to sit on the couch for a little. Need any help? Nope, nope. I'm fully capable. Yo, nice find, Mark. Hell yeah. That's no way to treat a guest. Spooky Todd. Very spooky. You know, if Chet sees this, he'll never hear the other Did any of you order pizza? I told you we were good with two boxes. It was probably Todd, genius. Hey, listen, man. We didn't order any pizza. Try the next house. It's getting cold. Why don't you take a peek? So you're going for the eerie silent slasher look, huh? I swear to God, if there are dicks in this box, we're gonna have some issues. 